counter narcotics and cooperation in AI. Reports suggest that the two sides are also expecting a call between their top military officials soon. Well, this was the first time that the leaders spoke since meeting in November last year. Around that time, both U.S. and China agreed to reopen military communications and also cooperate to curb fentanyl production. The agreement was seen as a sigh of relief amid their strained relationship. But during the call, the Taiwan issue took the center stage. According to the White House, Biden stressed the significance of upholding peace and stability in the Taiwan Strait and ensuring that the rule of law and freedom of navigation in the South China Sea as well. While responding to Biden's remarks, Chinese President Xi Jinping has made a resolute declaration emphasizing that the Taiwan issue represents the, the most insurmountable red line in U.S.-China ties. Although, according to reports, the Chinese president has acknowledged that ties between China and the U.S. are showing signs of stabilization. But she has cautioned about the potential of sliding into conflict or confrontation in the near future. The telephonic conversation comes as Washington and Beijing are at loggerheads on multiple fronts. Sovereignty claims over Taiwan is one of the main issues. China's support for Russia's war against Ukraine, human rights abuses in Xinjiang, denuclearization of the Korean Peninsula and lastly, tensions in South China Sea. 